Hey guys, so today I'm vlogging and I'm going to the beach with my friend Jasmine and her boyfriend Chris and I'm super excited about this because I haven't seen Jasmine in like three months um, so it should be really fun. Not really sure how much I'm gonna vlog. I literally think it's gonna rain today but we're going to the beach anyway. So yeah, this could be a really fun vlog or it could be a disaster but either way thought I would film. Haven't really vlogged in a long time and I thought this would be something fun. Um, so yeah. I guess we see what happens. So we're getting into the train station where Jasmine's supposed to be, but I don't see her. Oh yeah, I do. Okay, I see them. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Okay, you guys can't see anything because it's a blank train platform, but like, yeah. Is it open though? I don't know. Good question. I can't tell. Oh god. Devastated. Wait, yeah it is. It's just not open right now. It's open 12.30 to 10. What time is it now? About half an hour. Give us your best YouTube tutorial on how to build a bridge with sand. <laughs> Let me work out how to first of all. <laughs> <laughs> so you get your two, your two starting bases. This is where you get on the bridge and, then you dig and a off hole. the bridge. Don't dig a hole. <laughs> you should do. Dig a hole like Chris did. Yeah, look at that. Look at me dig away. With hey. a Coke bottle. <laughs> <laughs> yes. He didn't want to get a shovel. I, mean, I don't want your sand. Do. And you even out the sides. You do this side too. If somebody would stop adding sand to it. Well, you're on my hole. You're, you're on my bridge. Right, unless you can make the best bridge, yeah? yeah it's not as if the beach isn't big enough for the both of you. Like. <laughs> yeah, you make a nice little, nice little path through this bridge for the for the water. Give me some sand. I'm running out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm running out of sand. Then what you do, you should put your hand here, I think. I can't really remember how I did it. And you start attaching. Why don't you use the cook bottle? No, why use the cook bottle? Make yourself a little tunnel. That's actually an idea. Yeah. <laughs> I'll have, the be I'll have the better bridge watch. Oh, so it's not a build no, bridging bridge competition. competition? You stick to your hole, how about that? <laughs> and then tuck that bit out. Then we'll take that bit off as well to make like it a nice thin bridge. Beautiful. And there you have. A beautiful, wait no, you can't see through, hang on. Oh, shit. You need, we need light to come through. And here we have a beautiful bridge. <laughs> I don't even know where I'm going with this. Oh yes, you can see through to the other side. 
Hang on, you'll be able to see the scene. So artsy. My bridge will be better. You wait. Push it up. Push it up. Yeah, it will. Did you follow the tutorial? Yeah. Is that going to your bottles quicker? <laughs> it will do it, watch. And the magic touch. Hello! <laughs> yeah, now that's what you call a bridge, mate. Look at that. Clear hole. <laughs> ah, look at that. That is a bridge. Hey guys, so back from the beach, uh, just had a little bit of an outfit change. Not that you really saw what I was wearing before, but had an outfit change. Uh, now I'm heading to meet Jasmine and Chris because we're going for a drink. Um, beach was really good. I feel like I'm gonna update you more about this when I get home because literally I'm like walking along the side of the road and I don't like vlogging when I'm doing this, even though there's like no one around except for cars, but like, yeah. Anyway, point is, um, back from the beach, headed out again, literally was only home for what felt like five minutes, but I mean, I was there for like a couple of hours. Um, and yeah, so that's what's going on. Hey guys, so I just got home. Um, tonight took a turn. Um, I don't really want to get into details, but I mean, basically, there was this drunk guy who accused Chris of saying something under his breath, even though Chris didn't, and it turned into this whole big thing. Um, but long story short, um, Chris didn't say anything. This guy was just being drunk and obnoxious and just really confrontational. Um, but we made it out. We were safe. I think everyone was safe. I don't think anything really happened. Nothing got violent or anything like that. It was just, um, a situation that was kind of blown out of proportion. Um, but like I said, everyone's fine. It was fine. It was handled. It just kind of put a damper on the night. Um, because it's really not something that I think anyone really wants to deal with, but yeah, so there was a little bit of unpleasantness, but aside from that, had a good day. Um, like I said, I was at the beach. You guys have probably already seen it in the vlogs, but we went to the beach. We showed Chris Northern Ireland. He's never been here before. Um, so literally we were like, oh, we'll go to the coast. So we took him to Barry's. Barry's is the only um amusements that we have in northern ireland it's um it's a bunch of rides and by rides i mean there's about 10 solid rides and like one roller coaster um so if you want to call that an amusement park that's what it is um so we played games and then we went to the beach we chilled and then obviously came home uh went for drinks and then that bad thing happened so yeah that was the day in the nutshell. Like I said, I did have a good day except for that one thing, but sometimes that can't be helped. It happens. Sometimes when people drink too much, they get kind of aggressive and it's unnecessary and just causes drama, but it happens. Um, but like I said, everyone was fine, so it was okay. Um, and yeah, so that's what's going on. Uh, just wanted to end the vlog because it is 10 to 1 in the morning which is not the latest that I've ever ended a vlog, but I am really tired, so yeah. I don't really know when I'll vlog again. Uh, I know I might have plans with Jasmine and Chris again on Thursday, so I might try to vlog then again. That being said, we're not really doing anything interesting. Um, literally just gonna show Chris more of Northern Ireland. Um, and uh, also I have like pole dancing that day, so like, could be a fun vlog, I don't know. Uh, I do want to vlog things this summer, but I feel like I'm not really doing anything. I explained this in my life update video, guys. I like, my summer's not planned. I'm literally trying to go day to day, well, week by week, because I have a planner and I, I actually think about what I'm going to do later in the week. Um, but yeah, so I literally just go week by week. Sometimes things pop up and I make plans, other times not. So we'll see where the summer goes. Um, but other than that, I guess I'm going to go. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. 
and let me know in the comments below um, what kind of amusements and attractions do you guys have where you live because literally for us all we have is well I say all we have but I feel like we have quite a few things so like um, what we have here in Northern Ireland we have the Titanic we have Game of Thrones <laughs> um, we have Barry's um, I mean, there's probably lots of places that I'm like missing, but I mean, I think the staples of Northern Ireland are the Titanic, Game of Thrones, and also Barry. So there you go. That's Northern Ireland in a nutshell. Um, so yeah, uh, let me know if you guys have more exciting attractions. I don't know. Um, like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and uh, I will see you in my next one. Bye, guys. Thank you.